guys, welcome back to Lila's Mixed Up Videos. And today, I thought it'd be fun to make a snack because later today, we are going to watch a football game. So I'm going to make pretzel dough and with it, I'm going to make sauce pretzels and hot dog pretzel bites. So let's get started. Okay, so first I'm going to pour in the warm water. Okay. And next I'm going to pour in the melted butter. And then I'm going to put in the brown sugar. Whoa. Okay. And now I'm going to pour in the yeast. Okay. And I just want to tap it to get all the loose pieces out of there. Okay, and now since I have everything in, I'm just going to use a spoon and stir it. I just want to stir it pretty good. Get it all mixed. Okay. And then, once I have it all mixed, I am going to just let it sit for about five minutes. So, yeah. Alright guys, so it's been five minutes, and now I'm going to pour the salt in with the yeast, warm water, and melted butter mixture. And I'm just going to stir that quickly. And now I'm going to spoon most of the flour in to the bowl. Um, I don't want, I don't know, I'm not going to put all of it in yet because I don't know if I'm going to want all of it for sure. So I'm going to just put most of this in for now and then see if we need more. So I'm just putting this in and then we are going to need it. Okay, so that's probably enough for now. And now I'm going to put it in here and I just want to get it locked in place tightly. Okay. And now I'm going to put this down and I'm going to lock it in place and I'm going to turn it on just to the first spot. And now I'm just going to let it knead. Alright guys, so it has been going for a couple minutes and it's just pulling off from the, sides of, from the side of the bowl, and, but it's still a little sticky, so I'm just going to pull it off of here. And I, so I think I need to put some more flour, most of the rest of the flour in here and then oh ah, I said a little bit and then I think that'll make it just right so it's soft but not sticky. So I think that should be enough. So now I'm just gonna let it knead for a few more minutes. Alright guys, so it's been going for a few minutes, so I'm going to stop it now and pull it up. And you can see it's not sticky, but it's soft, which is just how we want it. So I'm going to pull it off of here now and take it, take the bowl here, hang on, get it up around the hook and I'm going to take the bowl off of here and I'm going to take the dough out of the bowl and I'm going to form it into a ball. I want to get it into a nice ball shape. And then, then I'm going to put it in this bowl and just roll it around quickly and then I'm going to flip it over 
to the other side because this bowl is coated in oil. So if I do it on both sides and just roll it around, it will get all coated in oil. So then I'm just gonna let it sit for a while and double in size. All right guys, so the dough is done and we needed it to get all the ear bubbles out. Um, it's done rising, it has doubled in size. This is just a little bit of it. And here, I already did a couple of hot dog pretz, of the hot dog pretzel bites that we are making. Um, and I put them on a baking sheet with oil on it. And now I have a little ball about the size of a quarter. Um, that I am going to roll out and then I will show you how to put it on a hot dog. But first, I'm just going to roll it out and you want it, you want it pretty long and you can kind of stretch it a little bit like this and you can kind of use both your hands and like pull out like this, stretch it. And just keep doing this until you want it fill it even until, oh my, it uh, is about, you want it to be about three hot dogs. So you can kind of measure it like that. And then you just take the end you and you put it on the hot dog and you just kind of wrap it around and you can stretch it some too. And then when you get it like that, you just want to pinch it, pinch it together so it kind of sticks together. And then put it on a baking sheet. All right, and then the next thing that I'm making is a sauce pretzel. So this is about like two quarters, um, about two of the balls used for the hot dog pretzel bites. So this, you want to do the same thing, roll it out, but you want to get it even longer. And you want, this one you, you want to get it super even. You want to get those even too, but these you need to be even more careful about. So I'm just gonna stretch it and try to get it pretty even. And um, you can kind of stretch it some. And if you see one spot that's like not, that's um, not as thin as the other ones, you can kind of take that and just like stretch that little bit and take your hand and just like push on that and just push it to try to thin it um, a little bit and get it even. And then, once you get it, you want it pretty thin. Once you get it thin enough, you make it into the shape of a pretzel. It's a little thin in the middle. Okay, that's probably pretty good. Then what you do now is you wrap it around. You wrap both ends around and you cross it over into the shape of a pretzel. And then you put it on the tray and then you move on to the next step. All right guys, so now we are going to boil the stuff in boiling water and baking soda, which has baking soda in it. So we are going to take two of these at a time and we're going to lower them down close to the water. You have to be careful because it's really hot. Um, close to the water and then drop them in and let them just kind of like flow and you can use the spoon, kind of move them around and they're gonna stay in there for 30 seconds. And then before taking them out, you just kind of want to move them around, not super fast, just let them flow. Move them around a little bit. For 30 seconds. And then take them out. Okay. I'm gonna put them right back on to the pan. And then I am going to 
take the pretzel here, put that on the spoon, bring that over, lower it down, and just take that. Ah! Oh, okay. Take that off. And slowly, I don't want to unroll it, so I want to be careful with this one. Kind of like gently stir it. And maybe, uh, if I can, flip it over to the other uh, side. I, I don't know if I can do that. Okay. Oh, I did it. Okay. And it's back over to the other side. <laughs> and just stir it around some until the 30 seconds is up. You want to do 30 seconds with this one too. Okay, now I'm gonna take this one out with the water drip. You want to do that for the hot dogs too. And then bring it back over here. I think I want to flip it. Oh, okay, why not? And let's put that back on the tray. And then we'll move on to the last two steps. Okay, so for the last two steps, we are going to use egg wash, which is one egg mixed with just a little bit of water. And so I'm just going to take a little bit of that and I'm just going to coat, uh, coat the, all, um, the sides and the top and get it all coated. And if you get some on the hot dog, don't worry about it. And you just want to make sure it's all coated good. And I'm going to do this with the hot dog pretzel bites and the pretzel. I'm going to do it with both. And then I have some coarse salt that I am going to put on. I just, I don't want much coarse salt. I just want a little bit of coarse salt. Just like, just like a little pin pinch, not much. Um on each. Really do not want much. It might be a little much. Okay. And then you're gonna get a little more on a pretzel. Because that's bigger. And yeah. And then that this is a this is the last step and this is the second to last step. So anyways that's how you do it and yeah. So I'm gonna do the rest um, of the pretzels or the sauce pretzels and the rest of the hot dogs and I'll be back. All right and we're going to bake them in the oven until they're golden brown. All right guys so they just came out of the oven. They're still a little hot but this is what the pretzel looks like and this is what the hot dog looks like. And um, so one extra st step that you can do to make them taste extra good is just take some melted butter here and let's get a little bit and just do kind of what we did with the egg wash. Just kind of, you don't have to get the sides as much for just the butter, but you can just kind of do what you did with the egg wash and just put it over and just get it kind of coated in butter, like we did with the egg wash on all of them. And then I think I might want to let them cool a little bit more, and then I think I'll try them. So I'm going to now let them cool, and then I'll be back to test taste them. All right, guys, so I think they're cool enough now to test taste them. So I'm going to try a hot dog first. Mmm, they're really good. Mm-hmm. The outside is like a little crunchy, not much, and it's really buttery and salty, but like not too much. And the inside is soft and they're really good. I really like them. But I am really excited about the pretzel. So I want to try the pretzel now. So I'm just gonna break off a little piece here to try. Mmm. Mm-hmm. They're like and the inside is soft like the hot dogs. And then the outside has a little hardness to it, like a little crunch, but not much. And it's like perfect. It's like buttery. Salty, 
I love it. Anyways, if you like this video, make sure you like, subscribe, and share with your family and friends, and hit the bell for notifications so you're notified every time I post a new video. Bye!